What we saw in Paris once we got a cell phone was that we used that cell phone number to look at cell phones it had talked to and not only Paris investigators but Belgium investigators were able to expand uh, the search net in a way that stopped a, a, a massive terror attack, an additional one in Paris, potentially has uh, led to the apprehension of uh, at least a dozen, if not more, ISIS uh, operatives throughout Belgium, Germany, and uh, parts of Europe. All right, helped thwart a second attack in Paris. Not only that, they were able to get information following the first attack so quickly. Is this putting Americans at risk? Well, S Senator, Senator Burr is uh, most respectfully mixing apples and oranges. When, when he talks about the cell phone, he's talking about a cell phone that one of these monsters left at the scene. That's hardcore evidence. It's very easy, lawfully, for a judge to say, okay, you have the cell phone, now go inside it, which basically means go to the phone company and get records of every person that called and every call that was made from. Mm -hmm. That's what investigators will use to track down the people that perpetrated Paris and in tracking them down to stop a future attack. That's not what the NSA does. What the NSA does and what some have said it can no longer do, which I will demonstrate to you is yes. incorrect, is gather um, uh, phone calls transcripts of phone calls, transcripts of, of emails in real time. Mm -hmm. Can it do so today? Yes. Tonight, the Patriot Act, the section of the Patriot Act that authorized that expires. Can it do so tomorrow? Answer, yes. Because now they can go to the individual telephone companies. Correct. Cell phone companies. Correct. They also have authority under an executive order issued by President George W. Bush in October of 2001, which is still valid. Remember, the NSA is a military entity. Mm -hmm. It's in the Defense Department. The president is the commander in chief of the Defense Department and tells military what to do. And he told them, President mm -hmm. Bush, to intercept all phone calls as needed. And President Obama has not interfered with that executive order. Now, if you listen, though, to uh, people with the NSA, people who have the opposite opinion that you have, they say that it's a scare tactic, that, that the NSA can't go in and just randomly connect to ev or uh, listen to everybody's uh, phone conversations, that, in fact, it has to be linked to a foreign number. Correct? Yes and no. Yes, the initial phone call has to be linked to a foreign number. Okay. But the, the FISA court has permitted the NSA to track phone calls to the sixth degree, which encompasses about 300 million people. And the population of the United States is about 330 million people. Mm -hmm. So the way the FISA court has interpreted this statute, A, A talks to B, and B talks to C, and C talks to D, and D talks to E, and E talks to F, and everybody F talks to is right. encompassed by the warrant. When you do that, you encompass everybody in the United yeah. States, and the NSA knows that and has been using that as an instrument to gather all this information. In the NSA's view, to keep us safe. The more information it gathers, the more it knows about the bad people. In the opinion of the critics of the NSA, it's too much information right. and they are not able to focus but on But they the bad haven't people. in reality been collecting all of that information from that large amount of people. I, I had our brain room do some numbers for us and they said the number of presumed U.S. persons who were the subject of these bulk uh, inquiries in 2014 was 227 and two, uh, 2013, 248. I don't know the origin of those, uh, of those figures because the NSA's records and the FISA court's uh, records are, are secret. But, I, for example, one of the warrants that I saw, which is on the Internet, it was released by, uh, by Edward Snowden, uh, authorized the NSA to capture the phone calls of every customer of Verizon. That's 110 million customers and about 150 million different telephone okay, numbers. So, so you mentioned Edward Snowden. Moving this forward, have we given the terrorist information, Edward Snowden specifically, so that they can go now and plan their attacks and know they need to go quiet? Because when you're talking about ISIS, they're using the internet, they're using cell phones. That's really how they're organizing things. They're probably and not. And they now know what well, not they're to do. They're probably not using cell phones because the 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 French have the ability mm -hmm. to listen to any phone call and read any email without a FISA okay, court, okay, without right, without a warrant, right, and they and weren't able to stop these guys so they're probably communicating but they were in able person to, they were able to stop a second one and look how quickly they resolved the first one 
they were able to stop the second one because they got the phone, the mm -hmm. hard evidence, and from there were able to find out who made the phone calls. It didn't involve any surveillance. It just involved old-fashioned police work. All right, Judge Napolitano, thanks so much for You're joining welcome. us.